alarmist, paranoid, conspiracy theorist, all nasty words people have used to insult and demean me. But now, after years of me trying to warn you all, here we are. Spider-Man has literally brought a plague down upon us. Why do I blame him and not Martin Lee? I do blame Martin Lee. He deserves swift justice, but he's a lunatic terrorist. This is what they do. Whereas Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Yet he obviously knew about the threat and didn't warn us. He either thought he'd handled it, which makes him criminally negligent, or he was in on it, which makes him a terrorist too. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh, my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. because Sable took over building security. Routine sweep, they're calling it. Checking for weapons or explosives or something. Yeah, that elevator goes straight to his penthouse. Are you sure he's up there right now? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! You can't treat us like animals! If I get sick, I'll sue you into the ground! Let us upstairs Why isn't Osborne down here? Disease. This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. How come Osborne never has to vacate his apartment for security sweeps? He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security room. No sweeps needed, they say. Plus, you know, he's the mayor. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Really 
I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Huh? Who's there? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. The fabulous Osborne boys. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? Wonder where it leads. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No phone found. Fire doors disengaged. 
Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in bello, peace in war. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? <sighs> 